The Disney Channel presents a world television premiere, Iron Will. A young man risks his life by entering a grueling 500-mile dog sled race in order to save his family's farm. Mackenzie Aston portrays the determined Will Stoneman. You know, Will's father dies right before his eyes, and there's nothing, there's nothing he can do to change that. I mean, he has to assume the, the, the male role in the family and, and, and you know, try to do anything he can to, 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 bring, to bring in the money to save this house. Mom, he was going to do this for me. Now let me do it for him. Just as Will Stoneman faced awesome natural forces in the story, so too did the cast and crew during the filming of Iron Will. First day of shooting, 28 degrees below zero. Everything on the entire production was frozen shut. I mean, they're beating on things with hammers to try to get them open. There were a lot of things to overcome. To do the making of the movie is the movie. It's just exactly what the main character has to go through. $10,000, Will. You don't have to die for it. In addition to the cold, the crew had to deal with shooting days that could involve as many as 98 sled dogs, an incredibly valuable antique steam engine, and a distressing lack of snow in Minnesota, where the film was shot. This has been the coldest, wettest winter in the history of this country since 1953, but in Minnesota, the mildest. And of course, we are right here. Tons of the frozen stuff had to be trucked into the various locations. And when a snowstorm was needed, special effects crews used potato flakes to create an artificial storm. While the dogs feasted on the fake snow, the human actors had to be flocked like Christmas trees. In about five minutes, someone's gonna come around and hang ornaments. Uncooperative weather is one thing, but with close to 100 dogs on the set at a time, director Charles Hayde found out fast that when it came to working with canines, a philosophical approach was the best. The dogs do what the dogs do, and you have to film what the dogs do. But what is wonderful and miraculous about it is the dogs do fantastic things. It's like they're doing what they're, they're, they're born to do. It's, it's amazing. They howl and howl and howl when they're, when they're held back and they can't go. And as soon as you start running, they shut right up. Along with Charles Hayde's enthusiastic direction, the cast and crew also found inspiration in the story they were telling. I think one of the reasons why this movie might touch people is because we all have that sense of wanting to achieve something that everybody tells us we can't. Will, you can't go on. Now, enough is enough. I'm going to get a doctor. No. I am one day short of the finish line, and not you or anyone else is going to stop me. It's a story of adventure, courage, and faith. A world television premiere, Iron Will, only on the Disney Channel.